When most people think of hazardous materials, they picture trucks full of chemicals, factories, and dumps oozing slime. Yet every home can be a warehouse of hazardous materials. Cleansers, bleach, oil, paint, thinners, batteries, medicines, pesticides, and more common household items hold the distinction of being hazardous. The average household contains between three and 10 gallons of materials that are classified as hazardous. Today, we'll see the proper way to store and dispose of chemicals and play it safe. Storage of household chemicals is something that many people do as a matter of convenience rather than safety. Most homes have a colorful mixture of poisonous cleaning supplies and chemicals unlocked and under their sinks, right where kids and pets have easy access. When trying to determine the safest place to keep household chemicals, the first thing you need to do is look at the warnings on the label and see if there are any precautions about storing it inside the home or with other chemicals. If possible, it is best to store household chemicals in a garage or shed away from the main inside living area. Make sure the chemicals are not near an ignition source and keep the storage away from the home water supply and air conditioning system. Keep chemicals in a cabinet, preferably at a higher level than children and pets can normally reach with the door locked or latched. Child safety locks like this can be bought at almost any home improvement store for only a few dollars. Keep household chemicals in their original containers. Reattach peeling labels with transparent tape. Buy only the amount that you need for the job to help reduce what you have to store. Also, make sure to buy products with safety closures. Take a look at the chemicals you have around your house, garage, and shed, including everything from cleaning supplies and oil to insecticides and paints. You'll probably find that some are so old they are no longer effective. A good rule of thumb is that if you cannot recall using the chemical in the past three years, consider getting rid of it. But whatever you do, do not put any chemicals down the drain or toilet. Containers that are considered empty rarely are. Used chemicals such as paint thinner and oil must go somewhere. All chemical materials have the potential for becoming hazardous waste and are a danger to people and animals. Safe chemical disposal is easy because you can bring chemical waste to one of three chemical collection centers three Saturdays a month. When transporting your home chemical waste to the disposal site, it's important to make sure the chemicals are secure in your vehicle so they won't spill or mix. On the first Saturday of each month, the Sheldon Road Center at 9805 Sheldon Road is available from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. On the second Saturday of each month, the South County facility at 13,000 U.S. Highway 41 in Gibsonton is open from 8 a.m. till 2 p.m. On the third Saturday of each month, the East County facility near Sefner at 6209 County Road 579 is open from 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. For safety reasons, there are some substances that are not accepted at chemical waste disposal sites. These include biomedical wastes, commercial wastes, explosives, radioactive materials, and medications. For information on how to properly discard these or any household hazardous waste, please contact the Hillsborough County Public Utilities Department at 813-272-5977. While it may seem that household chemicals are harmless, they have the potential to make you and your family sick, and in the worst cases, they can be deadly. So make sure you store them safely and dispose of them properly. Remember, play it safe and keep it away.